Hey, Warren Fackler here. I'm with Wall Street Realty. We are located in the San Fernando Valley. Today, I want to talk to you about short sales. What is a short sale? A short sale is where you owe more money in your home than what it is worth. Example would be if you owe $400,000 on your home right now, but it's only worth $300,000. Short sales seem to be everywhere. A short sale timeline is like this. If you are one month delinquent, you are now considered to be in default. Three months delinquent, the bank can file for an NOD, stands for Notice of Default. Six months delinquents, the bank can file for foreclosure date to sell your home. What will slow down this process? An offer into the bank. You deal with the loss mitigation department. The process of getting an offer accepted by the bank can take anywhere from 30 days to 120 days average. I have cases where the process has taken over a year. Why does it take so long? Three major steps. First, 30 to 60 days are paperwork. Seller needs an offer from a buyer with supporting real estate documentation. Buyer needs pre-approval letter from a lender stating how much they are qualified to borrow and proof of funds for the down payment plus any additional paperwork the bank may require. Paperwork from the seller that is needed. A financial worksheet. Last two years tax returns. Last two pay stubs. Last two months bank statements. A financial hardship letter. Any additional paperwork that the bank may require. This process has to be completed for every loan is that on the home. Also, any liens that are on the home have to be negotiated. Examples would be HOA liens or IRS liens. Second step, up to 30 days. After all the paperwork is completed, the bank will order a BPO, which stands for Broker Price Opinion. This is an appraisal of the house. Sometimes it's internal. Sometimes it's external. Sometimes it's done by a realtor. Sometimes it's done by a professional appraiser. There are several BPOs done during the short sale process. Third steps, bank will make an offer. Then negotiations will begin with the bank. If we reach agreement on the price and conditions, we go into escrow. If not, we start the short sale all over again. What will do this to your credit? Short sales will show up as settled debt will lower credit scores by 50 to 100 points and they will stay on your record two to three years. Foreclosures will lower credit scores by 150 to 300 points and will stay on your record for seven to 10 years. Some employers will not even hire you with this on your record. This is the life of a short sale in a nutshell. If you live in the San Fernando Valley, Santa Cruz Valley, or Canal Valley, and would like to discuss the possibility of selling a home, give me a call or leave me a message on Facebook. I want to thank you for watching my video. If you are facing any kind of hardship on your home, please leave me a message on Facebook. I can promise you that the first step is harmless and I am here to answer any questions or concerns that you may have no matter how small or insignificant you think it is. Everything will remain totally confidential. Please do me a favor and take a second to share this page by clicking the share button below this video. Almost a third of your friends that own homes are upside down, facing some kind of financial difficulties. Most of them have no idea what their options are. When you share this page, you could be helping someone's family. I appreciate you watching this video and spreading the word. I can bring the power of Wall Street to your street. Have a good day.